All right, so today we're playing some Mass Effect Andromeda. Uh, I just got aboard this ship here. Um, pretty close to the start of the game. I think we we're kind of finished with the prologue and we're gonna finally get docked here and check out this larger ship. So I'm playing this blind, haven't played this before. Um, so I don't really know where I'm going or what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna explore around a little bit. Captain wants to see a full duty roster. I just updated the charts. <laughs> so want to duty. see crew reassignments first. Start with not essential personnel. Ooh, a new assault rifle. Sweet. Okay, folks. This is what we've been waiting for. Let your teams know the docking procedures are now in effect. We've got 20,000 colonists still asleep, and we'll need somewhere to put them when the alarm clock goes off. As soon as we get clearance from the Nexus, we'll be following the basic survival protocols. We want to avoid any log jams, so it's vital your teams coordinate with each other. Any questions so far? Could be worse. <clears throat> Could be worse. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew, just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Got to have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. We all could. Yeah. Rough ride so far. We'll bounce back. Real food and a shower are just ahead. <laughs> Here we are. Uh, I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? Welcome to the Nexus, Gateway to Andromeda. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry, my code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Please select from the following pre-programmed responses. Uh, what year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented or confused upon arrival. Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Well, she's got the date right, at least. So where is everyone? How does the immigration process work? We ask that you submit to a brief medical exam to ensure your health and well-being after making such a long journey. Once you've been cleared, our colonization experts will assist you in finding your new home. Please be mindful of the queue. Thousands of eager colonists like you are waiting to begin their new life in Andromeda. Uh, where? Place is deserted. What can you tell me about the Andromeda Galaxy? Here in Andromeda, you are over two million light years away from the Milky Way galaxy. This is the furthest any life form has ever traveled outside our home system, making you a brave pioneer indeed. The Nexus itself is located in a region known as the Helios Cluster. Here, you and thousands of your fellow colonists will fulfill your dreams of settling a new home. Fortune awaits. What is the Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. Yeah. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for Milky Way colonists. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. Where do colonists live? 
Once you've cleared immigration, our helpful staff will assist you in choosing the home world of your dreams. Will it be the tropical paradise of Habitat 7? The gentle rolling hills of Habitat 3? Or perhaps the mysterious twilight world of Habitat 5? Whichever you choose, rest assured our Pathfinders have carefully vetted all colony worlds to ensure your security and prosperity. Oh boy. Habitat 7? That's where we landed. She's way out of date. That's all. It has been my pleasure. Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. And welcome to your new home in Andromeda, where the brightest star is you. Current wait time for immigration processing is... Unknown error. Right. That was helpful. Unknown error. Okay, so no answers from, from this person. Well, this can't be right. Actually going it's like on. everything's on standby. If it's a surprise party, they're doing an awfully good job of it. Mm. Plants are still alive. It's like they didn't finish building it. There's a guy. Maybe he's got champagne. Hi there. We're from Ark Hyperion, and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an Ark? Yeah, we just got in. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. But we thought you were all dead. What? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... <laughs> but you're here. You have no idea how much this means. I don't believe it. I'm Tyrion Candros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. I'm Scott Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Well, I've got a shipload of people that says we're here. Of course, it's just... You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Oh, okay. So, uh, my understanding of this is that these... These people came here first to set Everything this thing that could up. Go wrong with I, our I thought plan we were has. the first people to. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we called them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no shape to deal with an attack. We had a first contact situation on Habitat 7. Whole thing went south. They tried to kill us. That wasn't first contact. We know about them. Those aliens are going to be a real problem. This day just keeps getting better. Yeah, no We're here. here. You guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has what been fractured. Gonna, what do you mean you're going to check out the security the situation? <laughs> Is it true? They said That's like the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Duty. And no he one was expecting off. an arc to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. 
Food, water, we're short on everything. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. Alec is dead. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other Arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources, but that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A Golden World. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now falls to you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? Yeah, whatever. I may not have been the first choice, but I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. Oh, take a That's dump no on way me. to treat a guest. That is not the voice. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on the job training. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. <laughs> what? We could use a fresh that is perspective. That's not the right voice for that. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. Fair enough. So, you know, there's like. 80% more chit chat in this game. Let's have than a I private want. word in my office, like, Ryder. We'll discuss it. giving you a scout ship. Yeah. I'm happy to work out the details. This could have been all worked out on the prologue, and I, I just feel like everyone just shut up and let me play this game. Welcome to the Nexus. And we're still talking. Thank you for standing up for me there. Hmm. Hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance. Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. And when the power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't oh, happen. Oh, yeah, because all we and want is to just sit Come and talk see me to when everyone you have a all the time about anything and everything that we could possibly talk about. Can we just move on? Like what? Tell me what our task is and let me start working on it instead of just talking and talking and talking endlessly. It's just really a nuisance. I don't mind talking to characters if they're if we're picking up information or something, but it doesn't feel like we're picking up information. It feels like what it feels like is that we're uh, talking too much. Yeah. God damn it. Tram technician, please report to the Hyperion coupling attic. Like, I don't feel like we're gaining anything from the conversation. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat yeah, 7. Yeah, no shit. It no wasn't shit, even close the to livable. Where you landed. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion. And mine overrules hers. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the Golden Worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here. Eos. How? Oh. 
You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay. But you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look yeah. for another Pathfinder? <clears throat> Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Just point me to my ship and I'll be out of here. They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The Sweet. coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, keep see me and Sam on the Hyperion. Your implant needs uh, attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. Yeah, we need to no, stop this I'm in its fine. tracks to talk about something stupid. Uh, I, I could have guessed that that was going to happen. Uh, you can see I'm just like getting irritated by this game now because uh, I think it should have opened up already. Like it should have opened up a long time ago so that I could actually be what I think of <laughs> when I think of playing this game. Uh, instead, uh, we get this, oh, walk over here and talk to this person. And then before you get to the action, they're going to uh, just fuck around for a little while. And then after that, then you're going to have to go talk to this other person. And then there's going to be some delay, and then you can uh, go fuck around with something else hey, right now. Hey, you after. okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. What is there to be paranoid about? We've had three malfunctions in the past week. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Did you talk to security about this? How can I? For all I know, someone in security is the one doing this. I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can think of. You still have to report. But I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait. That's it. You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me. If they start hitting critical systems. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one. That'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omnitool. Just send me the See data this? when you're done. This fellow's giving me something to do. You know what no, I mean? Like, no, no, he's, he's not just talking at me and, and then, and then like, sending me to talk to somebody else and then Thank sending you. me to talk to somebody else. He's like, he's got something, something on, uh, on his plate. That I can do. How do I get the side quests? Additional tasks, uh, completed missions, Helios assignments. Ugh. I don't know. There's there's something about being long long winded that I, I find a nuisance, especially at the start of a game, where like there's certain things I get. Pathfinder, to cover their tracks, the saboteur is overloading power to this panel from another junction relay. You can scan and trace the connected wiring to locate the surrogate panel. Notice the handoff there. Too small for lizards. You'd be surprised. There's also for vine in the seed bank. Nobody's making 
Sorry, what was I? Uh, I, I missed that. I thought I was just supposed to scan the panel. I get it. Engineering reports. Hyperion power draw is now at one hundred percent. Oh hey, big fella. It's not right. It's not fair. What's wrong? Oh my, you're so it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband. He's locked up and slated for exile, for a crime he didn't commit. What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda, but the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have... There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Milken Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. Milken Rensis. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. But not right I'm now. I'm sure the I jailer need to, I need will to allow you a visit. Panel scan. Please. Tell Milken I love him. So, one more over here. Like, the, the first panel I scan has some kind of path leading off of it. And I have no idea what that's Scan and trace the wiring to locate the panel that the saboteur used. Oh, trace the wiring. Okay. Whoop. It's up there. No. It's... Engineering report. That mean it's upstairs. Whoops. You move like totally stupid when you got this this scanner out. It's a nuisance. Scanning power junction relays. This panel is malfunctioning. Without more data, I cannot determine if this is a normal malfunction or sabotage. I'll just disable power to the panel until Raj can check it out. Okay, it, I... Okay, whatever. We are on more power from Operation item. Center Site. Ben, this what? Is Alright, so I'm gonna go back down there. Figure this out. Oop, over oh, this way. Okay, we'll go upstairs this time. See if we can't find it. So all personnel be aware of any suspicious what? activity. Okay. Security we'll try this panel. Pathfinder, I received the data from Sam. It really is sabotage. Any idea as to who it might be? Yeah. All these panels were worked on by Zara. I just can't believe it. 
Security video logs confirm that Zara Kellis worked on these panels, as well as the one Raj Patil encountered. Well, shit. Any idea where she is now? Kellis is currently working on a panel on the Hyperion main deck.